shut that back a little bit. Slow here. Yeah. Good. All right. Just waiting on my baby dolls to come through. It's Saturday afternoon. I think today is the 18th of September 2021. I am trying some of this herbal tea that I got from the Dollar Tree. It's supposed to help build your immune system, so I'm getting ready to, to take my first sip. Hey, Kenyana, how are you? Thank you so much. Mwah. Right back to you, girl. I'm trying this tea, this herbal tea that I got at the Dollar Tree. It's supposed to help build your immune system. Two tea bags, of course, and so I'm like, you know what? I want to get as much immune booster as possible so I just took my first sip it's really good very flavorful and so just stirring it now good afternoon who just came in hi Kanitra happy Saturday I'm having tea from the Dollar Tree, it is so divine. And it's a really beautiful amber color. Let's see, oops. I tried to show you, but impossible. How are y'all doing this morning, actually this afternoon? Mm. This tea, y'all, is so good. So good, so good, so good. You're getting ready to make some too. <laughs> now that I've mentioned it. Yeah, grab you some tea, girl. Don't forget to get a cute mug though. Pinkies up. Hey, Frugonista. How you doing, girl? Happy Saturday. What y'all doing today? Catching up on homework. What are you studying, Kanidra? Y'all, this tea is so good. I'm about to make another cup. Oh my gosh. I'm not too sure about this coloring though. This is my natural complexion, y'all. Um, but it's looking orange. I'm looking a little, a little Oompa Loompa-ish. You're home alone? Come here, Connie. Uh-uh, come here. Y'all, I got a new rug to go underneath uh, my coffee table. It's white. I don't know if you can see it. I'm trying not to have him get on it. There you go, boy. There you go. Yeah. See that? I'm trying not to get him on that. Child development and nutrition. That is amazing, Kanidra. Congratulations on that. Hold on, what did you say? Hey, where are my glasses, y'all? I'm gonna have to put on these non delicious glasses so I can see my comments. Let's see. You're making berry tea, I love that. Hey, voluptuous. How you doing, girl? Frugonista, you don't like being home alone? I love it. You don't like it, though? You just had some tea, Frugonista. I love your tea kettle. What are y'all doing today? Frugonista, since you're home alone, girl, what does the Frugonista do when she is home alone? That's what I want to know. If, okay, let me guess. I would imagine the Frugonista, because I know you've been working hard all week, right? So you might be relaxing today. That's what I'm thinking. Today you might be relaxing. But y'all, I wanted to show y'all girls. I went into TJ Maxx. 
that's the thing about me is like when I see something that I really like, right? Then I think about it, especially if I don't get it, then I go back like a, the next day or a few days later and I get what I wanted and then I get a few other things. Uh, girls, okay, I've seen these cups before, but every year they do something really different. And so this year I went and got the um, coffee cups from TJ Maxx, the fall prints. And you get eight cups, eight lids and eight sleeves. And I thought that these sleeves were so cute. Hello fall. Aren't these cute with the cute little puppies? Let me bring it back a little bit instead of blaring, blaring you with these. Aren't these so divine, girl? I just could see myself just, you know, fixing myself a hot cup of coffee or some cocoa and going to the grocery store, not having to stop by Starbucks or Dunkin' Donuts because I've got my own girl. And these were only $3.99. And Clementine is a really good brand. This brand does so many cute little prints and stuff. And so, y'all, so cute. Should we open it up? Because I'm going to be rocking this. And you know what? You can use these cups more than one time. Okay, I can't open it up. But aren't these cute? You like them, Frugal Nista? So they had like the traditional like fall leaves and things like that and like daisies and things like that. And I think daisies, like the big yellow daisies are really in the season because I saw the print at Walmart, not at Walmart, but at the Dollar Tree. But I just love this one. Look at that dog right there with the cute little fall leaves. They are so adorable. So yeah, $3.99 ladies. And again, you can use these probably at least two times. One cup each time. And then I went back. Who was it? Kenidra? Kenidra or Kenyana? One of the K-beauties told me that Korean products, or no, maybe it wasn't y'all. Yeah. Maybe it was Christine. Somebody told me that products from Korea is amazing and a, a few days ago I bought a big thing of the summertime soap but it was a different scent right I think it was Kenidra and it was like some kind of weird flowery name or whatever so I was like you know what I love this brand shower time I love the packaging and I love lime and I love that it was on clearance for six dollars the reason why I like this so much let me not like really touch my face much um the reason why I like this shower time gel, soap, body wash, is because it lathers. You know how sometimes we get little cheap products and it's not really lathering? This product lathers so amazing. It does. Let me see the comments. Coney sitting behind me. He's like, ooh, she's, she's acting kind of mean. Let me kind of get away from her for a minute. <laughs> Uh, you're watching the puppy potty. Voluptuous says, I'm just, I'm just lovey. Enjoying my Saturday and decluttering my master closet. Girl, I hear you and I will be praying for you. Those are cute. I know. Love the prints. Coney is, Coney is Chihuahua. Oh yeah, the candeluba, yes. The herbal soap, yes. No, Coney is a Cocker Spaniel. Yeah, he's a little chocolate co Cocker Spaniel. Yeah. But yeah, so I just wanted to let y'all know that if you see this shower time, or this shower mate soap, and you can catch it on clearance, it's normally $8, but if you can catch it on clearance, sometimes you can get it for like four bucks. I recommend, I really, really do endorse this product right here. So that was something. And then I picked up another one of these Good Vibes body scrubs. I have one on reserve. And so I went ahead and purchased another one. I love these because they're foaming. And it was on clearance for $4.50. And again, remember y'all, when you're getting these, make sure that they are, are sealed and no one has poked a finger there. Um, but this stuff is really, really good. I'm using the Apple Teeny one now. And girl, 
it is it's amazing it's sudsy it's fragrant it's actually got like a little bit of maybe a little mineral oil in there so it makes your skin so soft and smooth so y'all remember i did a haul last saturday showing y'all some spa stuff right this is one of the ones that i showed you this product line here um which is the onyx bathhouse pick this up tj maxx girl i'm telling you you will love it you, don't, you okay, Connie? All right, let's take a little sip of tea. Y'all, I've been hanging up curtains downstairs because we've been here in this house for nine years and we have a big sliding glass door that has never been covered, right? It's just always been a nice picture, gigantic picture window. Well, we have a new neighbor that moved in um, behind us and they're not very nice people so I said you know what we're gonna go ahead and just I'm gonna go ahead and just get a nice big curtain rod put some fabulous curtains there so at night they can't see in because I'm, I'm just imagining um, them observing and watching us at nighttime I don't know my husband says that it's all in my mind but I just don't trust people so I, I hung up a curtain uh, last night and I feel so much better. I love it. Okay, so <laughs> I'm just laughing because I'm just like, the times are changing, you know, right before our eyes. And it's like the whole thing of feeling innocent and safe has all been taken away. And so we have to do things that's gonna help our mental psyche, right? And so if I had to put up a, you know, some curtains to feel safer, then that's what I did. And so when he came down this morning, he said, you should have done this years ago. It's so beautiful. I'm like, I know, I love it. So even though we have main neighbors and I'm looking that way because I can see them right now walking their Doberman pinchers, okay? This mean people, oh. But anyway, this is a positive video, positive vibes, okay. Yes, so um, I got some perfume, and this one is called Anna Sue or Anna Suai. And I know it looks girly girl, right? But I got it because it was on clearance for $10, but they actually, the normal price is $15. So I'm getting ready to show y'all how fabulous this bottle is, but most importantly, what is inside of this bottle is amazing. I'm going to definitely set my perfume game up. Um, I've been watching a lot of TikTok videos. And I mean, I didn't know of like all these different perfumes and things at different perfume stores that we don't have here in Atlanta. But there's this one in Dallas, Texas. It's a, I don't know what it is even called. But it's just got all these amazing, fabulous perfumes, all these beautiful bottles. And then, of course, the perfumes, the lowest one they have is $150. I'm like, you know what? Okay, I can get some, I can get just like one bottle, maybe two bottles for Christmas, right? <laughs> All right, but here, here is the bottle here. And I mean, she is just so fabulous. It's a mermaid. And I typically don't really like mermaids, but I got it because the box was opened and so I could smell it and it smells so good and so i don't have on any perfume today so the the little sprayer is right here and so i'll just spray it here and i don't have the notes but mm, i know that i don't have anything like this it has some notes of licorice like black licorice mm. It's like a soft black licorice with a little hint of, hmm, what would that be? I don't want to say nutmeg. Licorice, black licor licorice, a little nutmeg. 
a little bit of cherry tobacco. I know that's weird, right? Cherry tobacco. It's amazing. Uh, but you would never think that something in this box would smell like this. I mean, it is definitely, it definitely smells like a high-end perfume. Is that not amazing? So pretty. Yes, I love it. And so I got this one for $10, but again, it's at TJ Maxx for $15, regular price. Yeah, I normally would say I'm gonna get one more bottle for reserve. I'm not gonna do that because that's the old movie, okay? But if I was not watching my, not it's not even about spending. Just if I'm watching me not trying to hoard anymore, one is enough, okay? <laughs> because I've got perfumes for from years and years and years ago. Like I have the very first bottle of perfume my husband bought me was some Chanel and I still have half the bottle. You see what I'm saying? If y'all ever wanna see my, um, if you wanna ever see my high-end perfume collection, let me know y'all. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, Kanidra? <laughs> Good boy, Coney. Sit down and relax. So yeah, there's that. And it they had it nicely tucked away in here. But yeah, I love this perfume. And it stays on. Mmm. Unique. Okay. What is not so unique are these little um these little Gwen Stefani perfumes. Now, of course, the packaging is unique. I got these on clearance for $10. And so they're just basically like little five below scents, but it was $10. These are in uh, TJ Maxx too, but they're really nothing spectacular in my opinion. But the packaging is so cute with the little drips. And I thought she looked like a cute little sister right there with her little hair. And so I'm gonna show you what the bottle looks like. I'm not gonna spray it, but uh, these are, I think these are $12.99 regular price um, at TJ Maxx. And so this is what they look like. So cute to, dis to display. I was gonna say, you know, you can definitely gift these too, but I think I'm gonna put them in my china cabinet in the boutique and that's what it looks like. So, you know, they don't return perfumes anymore because of the pandemic, y'all. Um, because if they did, I probably would return them because, again, the scent is good, but it's nothing spectacular. Like, let me go ahead and spray some. It's nothing spectacular. It's not worth the money. Let's see, I'll spray it here. And kind of let it air out a little bit. No, it's nothing spectacular at all. I'm kind of mad. <laughs> but anyway, it's cute though, right? It's so cute, but nothing spectacular. I mean, it smells good, but it's just a basic little, little scent. So there you have it. So there's that one. And I'm probably going to throw these boxes away. And then another one that I got, this one is called, well, this first one that I showed y'all is called Music, the bottom there. This one is called Little Angel. And this is what it looks like. Here. It's cute, Kanidra. I know, right? It's cute. All right. So here is Little Angel. And I love the back of her hair. She's cute. And this is what she looks like. All right. She smells better, honestly. She smells, she kind of reminds me of being a teenager. Um, she kind of smells like, what does that smell? What does that musk smell? Jovan musk? Maybe. Mm, 
No, I mean, it's okay, it's okay, but no, no, wasn't a good trip. I'm going to give these to my little nieces. I've got a couple of little nieces. I'm going to, th this is going to be their Christmas gift. <laughs> so I'll keep the packaging because this is, I don't even want to say it's their little girl scents. They're just, just random smells. I'm really disappointed in you, uh, Gwen Stefani, because normally Gwen Stefani does really good perfumes. But anyway, they're cute though, right? Cute to cute. All right, so, yeah. Sometimes we don't really buy the best things. And you know what, girl? I even had nerve to say, okay, well, I see a pink one in the collection. Let me get the pink. No, we're not doing that. Okay, you got me for 20 bucks, Gwen Stefani. So Christmas gift for a little niece and another Christmas gift for a niece. Okay, so what does this say? I don't know, girl. Hold on. It says, a fatal attraction to cuteness. A fatal attraction to cuteness. Um, I just noticed this. It says, a fatal attraction to cuteness. No. Uh, these, you, no. I don't even think I'll be giving these away as a gift, girl. I'm going to see if I can find my receipt, and I'm going to try to get my money back for these. If y'all see these... These are horrific, but they're cute packaging, but horrific. Oh. Okay, last one, Amber Crombie and Fitch. However you say it, this one is amazing. This one is called uh, First Instinct Sheer. Grown woman packaging, love her, in the beautiful brushed gold. And then, let's go ahead and open it. And I have smelled this one, and I do love it. This is the packaging. <laughs> hey, you know I'm going to keep it real on here, girl. No way. Those perfumes are good. getting out of here. So here you go. There's that. And it smells so good. I don't know the notes of this, but it's beautiful. Girl, it is beautiful. It's got a beautiful, sweet smell. A little bit of grownness. I don't know the notes, but I do love this. I love this so much. And I love the bottle. She's going to go amazing in the uh, china cabinet. And so, yeah. So we'll just play it all by ear. If they don't return it, then we'll just see what happens. Uh, Kanita, she's laughing at me. I never buy their scents. Which one? Uh, these right here by Gwen Stefani. Yeah, don't do it. What's the name of which one, Kanidra? These, so this one is called Music. The one that looks like this. And this one is called Little Angel. Now these should be at the Dollar Tree, okay? These should definitely be at the Dollar Tree. Yeah, they should be. I have some Dollar Tree perfumes that smell a hundred times better than those. So they have their nerve. So this one says a fatal attraction to cuteness. Doesn't make any sense. And then this one says, same thing. Girl, Gwen Stefani, if you're watching me, girl, Send me some other kind of products for free, okay? Because I just wasted my money on this. You listening to me, Gwen? No Amber Cranby. I never buy. I meant the first one you showed with the horse. Oh, you mean the one with the mermaid? This one? Now, she smells good. She smells so good. This one is by Anna Sui or soul anyway it's called fantasia mermaid by anna sui amazing i endorse this one for sure i'm always going to tell you the truth about stuff 
this one is good and it's worth definitely worth fifteen dollars yeah this one has um this one has a little cherry tobacco in it you know cherry tobacco black licorice um a little bit of that little medicinal just a little hint of it i just oh i love it Mm hmm oh yes girl it's just it is um i don't know the word for it it's just it's just if i could just give you a sound it's mm, that's what this is girl mm. love it all right and then speaking of the dollar tree y'all i did go yesterday to get a few essentials and i found a couple of um <laughs> you said it retails for seven dollars <laughs> well it's worth more than seven dollars that's for sure Oh, $78? Um, I don't know if it's worth $78, but I would pay a good $20 for it. I'd pay a good $20 for sure. But uh, I finally found some hard candy um, lip products, y'all. And they only have this color here. It's red. It's called Glitter Reveal Lip Color Press and Play Glitterazzi. And I love the cap. And if I could open it for you, I will. Yay. I got it open. Hard candy. I've been rocking with hard candy for years. Love her. Love the packaging. It looks like whenever you see this, that means it's a little old. It's kind of separating a little bit. It's been sitting there. All you got to do is just kind of do that. I always smell stuff. And then, let's go ahead and do just a little swipe. Oh, this is a beautiful matte. I love matte lipsticks. Okay, that's what that is. I don't really see any glitter. Basically, what I see is I see shimmer. I see some shimmer in that. That's beautiful. So, good deal. Got two of these, one for me and one for a friend. And another thing about hard candy is it's pretty good stuff because look, it's still there. Even after I've wiped it off, it's still there. So pretty good. Have y'all been able to find any hard candy in your Dollar Trees? I haven't been looking. Uh, but I did yesterday and I came across these two and I said, okay, you're coming home with me. So just got two of them. I thought this would be a good uh, Christmas gift. So the one that I opened is right here. So I'll leave that open. So I'll know that's the one I put on my hand. Uh... Was a still? Really, Frugonista? Thank you so much for letting me know. Yeah. So, okay, I got this for $10. So, even though I paid $10 for this and got ripped off with these, we'll just say I paid 30 bucks for this, right? So, I'm fine with that. And this time, girl. This time. I know, I don't know what's going on with that. But you know how the Dollar Tree is for Guanista. And that's why it's so frustrated, frustrating when you watch Dollar Tree Hall sometimes, which I really rarely do. But when I do, and then the next day I'll go out to like maybe two or three Dollar Trees just to see if they have it and they don't. I'm like, you know what? Forget it, okay? I'm navigating my mind uh, this way because you are not going to get me going all over Georgia looking for this and looking for that. So, yeah, Dollar Tree is a trip with that. Um, but I went to Ollie's last night, and they had some cool things. And I had never seen this. Have y'all seen this Gain Essentials with Essential Oil? This was $1.99. They only had three left. I, I purchased two of them. But I did, oh, 
It, I couldn't even open the bottle good enough and it smells so good. Mm, it's got essential oils in it. I can't, I'm not even going to try to explain what this smells like, but girl, if you can get these hands on, if you can get your hands on this, I'm hoping that they will sell this in the Dollar Tree or go to an outlet store or something. Girl, get your hands on at least one of these. Ah! Oh, it's, girl, what does it smell like? I love it, I love it. It's, it has a little bit of mint in it. It's got mint, it's medicinal, it smells like that typical gain smell too, infused and with it. It smells therapeutic. It smells like a spa. That's what this stuff smells like, girl. Gain with the essential oils. <sighs> That's what the color is. It's lovely. So I'm going to ration this out, girl. I'm just going to do my sheets, my bed sheets with this. Mm. Okay, I'm so sorry. This is good. I love it. Ah. Mmm. Oh, do you, do you know the spa? The spa. I can't even talk. Do you know the spa smell? Say that ten times. Spa smell. <laughs> Say it ten times with me. Do it with me right now. Spa smell. Spa smell. Say it fast. Did you mess up, girl? Did you? But anyway. The smell that's in the spots, that beautiful aroma, girl, is in this bottle. I'm mad that I got there too late, okay? Because I probably would have bought 10 of these. Mmm. Get this in your life. Let me try to take this sticker off so you can see. Have you seen this? Gain with essential oils. <laughs> Gain with essential oils. I'm having too much fun, girl, laughing at myself. Ollie's, oh, Ollie's. <laughs> Mo makes you want to run out of shot. I'm so sorry, Frugal Nista, but I had to share. I have to, when I find some really cool stuff, I have to come out and share with y'all. Fall is a good time to get some fun stuff. Kanibra, I wish you could smell this girl. I got Frugal Nista here, Kanidra. Okay, did y'all say, uh, what was that word I told you to say 10 times? Spa smell. Did you say it 10 times? Fast. But yeah, Ollie's girl. Cheap. Things are going up in price in stores though. I'm kind of mad about that. I'm like, you know what? You have your nerve. You know that you had that on sale, not even on sale, regular price normally at $1.88. I'm talking about these um, clear waters at Walmart that we love. They're zero calories and they have different flavors like orange, mandarin orange. My favorite is the peach, uh, strawberry. Those used to be $1.88 just last year or the year before, we'll say 2019. $1.88 for 12 do you know I went into Walmart a couple days ago and they have increased the price to $3.88? I was so mad. I was like, where is the corporate manager? That's what I wanted to say. Hey, how dare you change my water sodas? They're not sodas, but they taste like soda. How dare you change them? Change the price. I was so mad. Anyway, getting back to Ollie's. They have Uncle Ben's. <laughs> the boiling bag rice uh for a dollar 29 so i said you know what that's a good deal isn't that ridiculous i was so mad and i've never tried these before the boiling bag i really haven't and so i remember my grandmother back in the day used to 
Um, but this one is just the regular white and white and rich long grain rice. And then I found just one of the wheat one. So I said, I'm gonna do some stir fry tonight. Let's open this up and see, because $1.29 is good for this. Now I'll pay $1.29 and I got this at Ollie's. I got this at Ollie's. Oh, okay. There's one, two, three, four. And we always gotta make sure there's no critters and stuff in these. I'll check it out later. But yeah, not too bad for $1.30, you know, four bags of rice. And so, um, there's that. Prices are going up and I'm so mad about it because it really doesn't need to. They're just taking advantage of us. And then here's something that was hidden. Uh, this is an exfoliating facial cleanser with vitamin C 2-in-1 by Body Prescriptions. was on clearance for $2 at TJ Maxx. And the thing that I liked about this one is it was sealed, y'all. It was sealed. So let's go ahead and open it. Because I'm always looking for nice little face cleansers. I don't smell anything. A little bit. Yeah, I do. Smells like grapefruit. And so I just love the color and I love that it has like the little scrubbers in there to kind of help exfoliate a little bit. And so um, this is good. It says rinse face with warm water to dampen skin, gently massage into face and go in an upward circular motion, avoiding the immediate eye area. Rinse thoroughly or remove access with a damp washcloth. And so the ingredients, water, cellulose, huh, Jehovah, Jehovah something, and then castor oil and a whole bunch of other things that I can't pronounce. But nonetheless, so pretty, and I thought this would look really nice on my little counter in the master bathroom. So $2, normally probably three dollars who knows but yeah got that and then y'all know that I'm doing art therapy classes and so I needed some I needed some canvases so you get two of them for five dollars oh yes I always get facial cleansers with vitamin C very good for your skin and you would know Kenidra so yay thank you girl so yes I did get this and it's exfoliating and so I'll just use it like one time because you know I don't want to mess up my skin but anyway I'll let y'all know how I like that but yeah you get two 16 by 20 um, canvases at five below so this is gonna be great for our class Kenidra uh, when I do host the class again which is coming up soon next week and then also at five below also at five below I got I want to show you this from the dollar tree too I got some really awesome paint brushes look at all these paint brushes that you get 25 for five bucks girl Okay, everything to work with. I love these blue ones. So I have a really fun class that I'm, I just saw a bird fly by. Anyway, um, totally get distracted. I'm so sorry. But anyway, I have a really fun class coming up next week, y'all. Um, this is, yes. Uh, oh. That is so good, Kenidra. That is exciting. Let me know what you end up making and I wanna see it somehow. I wanna see what y'all design. So yeah, I got 25 brushes. And then they have some paints at uh, Dollar Tree, the Tempura watercolors. And I've been wanting to do some watercoloring uh, paints. And so this is the Tempura, you get five of them. So, I'm adding this to my art stash. And so what I do 
for my art therapy class is I just put everything in this bag. Everything, all of my things that I'm going to be working with. And so, yeah. Kenidra, what are you laughing at, girl? What you laughing at? I know, Kenidra, I'm like probably one, like one of your old aunties. I know I remind you of one of your old aunties, girl. <laughs> oh, it was a smile face? Oh, oh, I see it. Thank you. Thank you, Kenidra. I'm so excited that you and your husband are painting. That's so cool. Wow. I'm just speechless. I just can't stop smiling. I'm like, oh, <laughs> that is so great. So what are y'all cooking today? I can't believe the lighting in here. This lighting is like, woo. Now I feel like washing my hands and there's nothing to wash my hands with. Are y'all like that too? I just feel like washing my hands, like ugh, I've been touching stuff. Yeah. So it's a beautiful day here in Georgia. It probably, probably is like maybe 85 degrees or so. So one of my friends wants to go to this, uh, this little park concert again. Veggie lasagna or some type of pasta. That sounds so good, Kenidra. I love veggies. I, I really do. So I'm going to I have to figure out what I want to do today. I think I'm going to do some, some fried cabbage. I love cabbage. And then something odd that I'm going to do in addition to cabbage is I'm going to do some roasted cauliflower. And then I'm going to do some oyster mushrooms. They are so divine. And um, that's gonna be a lot of food right there. So that's gonna be it. Oh yeah, and then a bag of one of these things of rice. So yeah. If you want me to come back and show you the finished product, I'll do that. So I've got five people watching. I got Kanidra here. I've got Frugonista here with me. And Texas Girl is missing. Where you at, Texas Girl? Um, she's probably busy. And then I'm sorry that y'all left. Give me a thumbs up if you did like this video or this live video. Uh, you want to see Kanidra? Okay, that'll be fine. That will be definitely fine. I'll bring you in the kitchen and we'll do a little bit of um, cooking. I'm looking at my comments coming through from TikTok. I love TikTok, y'all. Can you tell? I am just loving TikTok. I'm here pulling down a wall, just listening. Pulling down a wall, what? You are actually physically pulling down a wall, girl? Renovation? I wonder if we have enough juice. I was gonna bring you in the kitchen, but better not. So y'all, I'm gonna go ahead and go. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, I think I'm gonna mop my floors again. I try to do that twice a week. So I think I'm gonna mop the floors. What else am I gonna do? I'm gonna fold some laundry. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going out or anything. I'm staying right here in this house. <gasps> kitchen renovation. How do you do it? I am praying for you right now in the name of Jesus. Girl, I would love to have my kitchen renovated. However, mm, or right now my nerves and then the whole germy stuff. Yeah, I'm not, I'm gonna wait on that. 
I'm going to wait on that. But Frugal Nista, I'm excited that you're getting your kitchen remodeled. I know it's going to be amazing. You've got amazing taste. I love your taste. And so I'm looking all around here, looking at a couple of things that I need to do. Like I said, I'm going to do the floors. I'm going to finish my laundry upstairs, change out the linens and then cook dinner. So I'll probably come back later, y'all, so you can kind of see what I'm cooking, what have you. I'm gonna put away some of this stuff too. But I just want to say hi to my girls. Hope that you're having a good, happy Saturday. And uh, y'all, you know, be safe out there. Do what you do. Put on some uplifting music and encourage yourself through Jesus. And that's gonna be it, y'all. I love you, but God loves you so much more. Remember that pretty is as pretty does, and I'll see you in the next live. Bye. Mwah.